I just hung out in the Devil's Punch Bowl. Anything for footage. It's good. Right. That's it's good. good. Right. And I'm taking you down. Right. I'm taking right. the throne of razor climbing, cookoff.com. Lost. Yeah, you are my Carol it's Baskin. Good. I have a okay. Feeling, but okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 okay. We're back. It's been a good day. Uh, we went to Agate Beach. Man, show up early because you're not clamming if you're not there early. Duh. Uh, we got our limits. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean that. I love you. Go clamming. Um, we got our limits of clam. It was tough. A lot of up and down the beach. It was rough, rough. Uh, oh, surf dude. last night. I well, mean, we it, it was tough clamming, but we did it. Um, I have a channel, Coast and Compass, which you're watching now. I would really appreciate if you like and subscribe. And he has a web a website, RazorClamming.com. Check it out. It's got all the info on how to do cleaning, cooking, location. He just redid the, uh, the site too, and it's beautiful. Um, so that's it. It's a challenge. I challenged him $50. He challenged me $50. That's a total of $100. Whoever wins this clam cook-off. I wish you all the luck. You're going to need it because I got some secrets. Oh. Super secret stuff. This, I'm, I'm really, I yeah. taught you how to clean clams. Remember? When yeah. you were five years old? Yeah. And that gave me a lot of time to study up on yeah. other things like super well, secret stuff. Okay. But $50, I'm taking you down. Pal. All right. This is no mercy. I don't care if you're my nephew. Uh, you're you're going to this home. 50 bucks. It won't stop. I'm retired. Here we go. I need the money. He needs money. That's it. I don't blame him. <laughs> 50 bucks on the line. Here we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> different because I don't just want to have a regular old clam. They're never regular old clams. They're always fantastic clams, but I want to do something a little different. So today we're basically going to make a little medley to put on the top. And what we've got here in the pan today is we've got some butter. We've got some button mushrooms sliced up. Of course, garlic is good for everything and some onions. And we're going to cook this down and then we're going to caramelize them by adding some sugar to it and on high heat cooking it until it turns a little brown, a little caramelization. And that's why the breading's so light because we still want the clam to stand out. We don't want to totally smother it. So we want a light coating with a nice little topping.
So it was $50, now it's $100. Things are getting a little personal, getting a little crazy, getting hot in the kitchen. Okay, everybody, this is a 30 second how to clean a razor clam. So you got up early, had some pretty good luck, uh, got your limit. So now, important business, how to cook and clean the clam properly, respect the clam. Here we go, one clam. Boiling water, clam in boiling water. Until the shell pops, it should only take about five seconds. That just popped open now. And it goes into a pot of ice with cold water. But boiling water, five seconds, shell pops open, put it in the, the ice. The next is the cleaning part, which I'll show you right now. Uh, we got everything, we got the scissors. You can use pruning scissors, or you can use these kind of scissors, any kind of scissors. Uh, they work really well. All right. Um, anatomy 101. You got the neck, you got the foot, and the middle part, which is the good part, so three parts to a clam. The neck, the siphon, clip that off. We are using that for bait, surf perch, crab bait, scissors go in here. And you just go up until you find that first hole. There's two holes in the siphon, and you got one on the top and one on the bottom here. You'll find it with your scissors. And you just keep on snipping that up, bam, that's one. And then you come down here, there's another little hole here, and you're gonna follow that all the way up. Okay. So the rest, you have your, your gills right here. Clip those off real careful. Clip that right here. Okay. Then, you got the foot. The foot. You just fillet right down the middle like that, bada bing. Open that up. You're gonna have a bunch of guts. It's natural. Scoop them out. Little water. Boy, those are really in there. That was a healthy clam. That was a healthy clam, a hungry clam. Beautiful clam. And there you go, there you have it. You have one completely clean razor clam, ready to fry. Perfect. Okay, clam in the egg wash, in the panko, on the pan. You've gotten your clams from the ocean. You woke up early. You kept them alive on the way home. You found them, you did all the great stuff. Good for you, because this is fun. This is, the clam is great. But now, pro tip, you throw them in the refrigerator after they're done, uh, after you get them done panko. That will keep everything from falling off into the pan when it comes time to frying them up here. So we're gonna do that, keep them in for an hour, and we'll see you there. Unnecessarily. So Rick's gonna win this. I can clam, I can't cook. That's my problem, okay? So take it easy on me. Down in the basement in the comment section. You shouldn't have said that either. This is <laughs> going <laughs> embarrassing. I'm gonna take it off gently. Nah, I could have probably done a better job, but you know what? I'm not a cook, I'm a clammer. And that is gonna be my razor clam. I have a feeling. I'm gonna be today, but that's okay, it's been fun. And I'm never gonna hear the end of it. So, here we go. All right, we did our clams, and I'm thinking I have this in the bag. Rick made something different. I've never seen that before, but hey, it looks good. I just went traditional. Uh, your bacon, or your Crisco, your panko, your clam, and we're gonna see who wins. Nate, M, do your thing as judges. We wait in anticipation. Well, I love the neck, so I'm going, Peace I like from. the color of the breading. Looks nice. If I can get mine on fork. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Good chew. Really good crisp. Tastes like clam. Mm -hmm. A little buttery. Nice flakiness from the panko. I like it. That's a clam. One to ten. That's a nice crisp One to clam. ten. What is that? An eight. I'm gonna give it a hard seven nine. Five. Seven point five. Yeah. Nice. Typical. Nice. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> Average. <laughs> okay, so here we go. <laughs> that was a seven point something. What do you think, Emily? It was just. It was good. It was I good. Also about, yeah. She's so nice. She's so kind. Thank you, Emily. I appreciate that. Okay. All right, yeah. Uncle Rick's clam, razorclamming.com recipe. Mm -hmm. Let's see how it holds up. I'm going for this okay. right here. Yeah. There's a lot on. There's a lot going on in this clam, but it looks really good. There's a lot going on. Looks really on, yeah. good. Do I get some left. mushrooms? I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep clam. it. I'm gonna keep it consistent, and I'm also going to get a neck. Okay. Get a little mushroom. Get a little onion. Get everything in one bite. Looks good. All right. Oh my god. That's um <laughs> There's a lot going on there. <laughs> so still got the chewiness. Mm -hmm. I'd say it's a little bit more consistently chewy all the way through. There's um you got breading, there's some sweetness from the onions and the mushroom, but there's also a fattiness and a richness. I like how light the breading is, but yeah. it's still super crispy. Breading is super light, but you feel it all around the clam. Mm-hmm. Okay, um, I think I know what I want to give it. Yeah, you know? same. You go first. I'm, I'm going to give it a nine. Yeah! I'm, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was going to go straight for ten. Yes! Ten! I was taken somewhere with that bite. Yeah, no, it's, it was it's an a lot. Emotional I mean, experience. like right now. It was an I'm, emotional experience. Right now, I want to go for another bite. Of both. Oh! Of both. Of both. Of both. Of both. Yeah! Take some mushroom <laughs> off and just do the clam itself. Yeah, you know I'm gonna try. Let me try. Let me try. Let me see. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Tell me you wouldn't give it at least a nine. And that was all mushroom. That was what? all mushroom. You gotta get the clam. I'm doing this whole clam. Just do it. The whole. Okay. Do it. Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> just give me. Okay. Well, our next video, we're gonna be the second <laughs> clam. We don't know what it is. Because you know what? That is really good. I gotta hear it. You know, if you've been doing this a long time, that's a great recipe. My poor little clam law. I want to eat both. I just want to eat that one first. Yeah, that one's win. That's probably going to dip. Yeah, that one first. Man, yeah, great, great. Boy, that was really good. Look over there. Oh, and there goes the money. So here we go. I got the money. <laughs> another, another good video. So if you liked it, uh, Coast of Compass. Razorclamming.com, we do these videos a lot. There's going to be more of them. Like, subscribe, please. Thank you for joining us. And um, shoot, what are we going to do? We'll do something next weekend. We'll, uh, we'll see you there. So he goes in the closet, he comes out with no shirt on. I'm going, oh my God. I, I flipped too many times. I've killed this clam. We're not gonna use that clam. Nope, that clam never happened. That clam never happened. <laughs> oh no, you eat the clam.